Hi, I'm Sarah Dick, and I am your Jamberries nail representative for the party today. I'm going to show you how to apply um, your wraps. Actually, I'd like you to watch the official application video because there's nothing wrong with that. It's really good and it's done in a very professional way and it looks great. So, um, but just put them on until you get to this point. All right, see the tip is not cut off or anything because I'm going to show you a few tips and tricks that might help you to keep your nails on a little, your wraps on a little bit better. Um, the first thing is that once you have your wraps on, first thing of all, try really hard not to touch this part of the wrap that's going on your finger. Okay. Um, second of all, once you have it to this point, you're going to, you might have some bubbles. All right. And, and actually what, when you get to this point, um, I want you to use your rubber, rubber cuticle pusher and really push down on those edges. Okay. Really get them down nice and hard. You might even reheat the, the wrap again while it's on your finger and, and, you know, let it get nice and hot and soft again, and then just really push those edges down. It's hard for me to show you cause I'm using my wrong hand, but, um, really get those edges nice and pushed down. And then once they're all pushed down and you're, you, you have nice flat, everything as much as you can, you might still have a few bubbles or a few ripples. So you're going to take this end and just gently pull it and you're going to kind of work it back and forth a little bit and you're going to pull and pull. Okay. And that's going to pull out any, any ripples that you might have. And then you're going to carefully use your scissors and you're just going to cut the tip off. All right. It doesn't need to be perfect because you're going to go back and use your clippers in a minute. Now, one thing that they say to use in the, in the official video is a, a file. And I don't agree with that because I don't feel like it gives you the best application. So what I want you to do is take this edge and clip it and clip it with your fingernail. If, if you have long enough fingernail to, to clip, which I don't right now, but um, you're going to clip it along with the fingernail. Okay. So you're going to have this. So this is the edge of your fingernail now with the wrap that's been clipped off. And then, oops, I got to clip this just a little tiny bit more here. And then what you're going to do is, um, you're going to reheat it again, but you're going to put it into some plastic first. Now you can use a baggie, which, which is what most people say, you know, use the baggie method, but I just use whatever plastic I happen to have handy. So this is just a plastic grocery bag. And what you do is you put the finger in it and you're going to really press that finger into it. Now you don't want to press so hard that you go through it, which is why I like to use a stronger bag than a baggie. So you're going to press that finger into it. And then I have my, my little heater down here. You're going to heat the finger up again. All right. So now it's hot and then you're going to take your, your cuticle pusher and you're going to push that edge right on there. Again, you're going to push it nice and hard and just push, 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 push the, the edge, especially the end, but all the edges all the way around. And you're, you really want that on there nice and tight because that's going to get rid of any, any ripples at the edges and anything else that that might be coming up this is really going to help to seal the edge to seal that tip i should say so that you're not going to have the lifting that you might get otherwise um and then my other tip is if you have really really curvy fingernails if they're curling you know if they curve this way or if they curve this way you might get a little bit of lifting on the edges here and the on the sides if you have that then you might need to take your scissors and just clip, just kind of clip a little tiny piece right there so that it can lay down flat. Um, otherwise, I think that this should give you a really good application. And the thing is that you might, you know, like I have a little tiny bit of my nail showing right there. It happens. It's just kind of the way that it works. But nobody's ever going to notice that. And it still looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and do my other nails and I will see you next time. So I really hope that this helps and please let me know if you have any other questions or any other issues. All right. Take care.